Hmm. We got some good news today. What's up, y'all? Intro time. Oh, oh we have our terrible Reggie Pizza Man! <laughs> OB1 plays. Yes, right. What's up? Hello, All right. OB1 plays. the vibes before you get started watching this video give me a big thumbs up thanks 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 we are having a playstation 5 giveaway in october one subscribe to this youtube channel two follow me on twitter and you are in an epic epic console giveaway we're going to talk about ps5 and the recent later on but <laughs> First news item, uh, this is pretty dope. This was actually announced yesterday, I think, but Ghost of Tsushima, the Legends mode, the multiplayer mode, it looks like we're gonna be getting an upgrade update coinciding with the launch of the DLC Ikishima Director's Cut. So, first of all, there's gonna be a new mode called Rivals Mode, where two teams will be competing not directly against each other, but against um, and, um, other um, NPCs to see which team could get the most kills and progress the farthest. It looked pretty cool. I'm telling you, I'm gonna be on this uh, Ghost of Tsushima uh, Legends mode. Once the update drops, once the update drops, I'm not playing this at 30 frames. I'm assuming um, it's gonna be at a smoother frame rate on the PS5, but that can't wait for the ikashima expansion also 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 with this new um update there's going to be tons of new features coming with this multiplayer mode and it's going to get its own standalone release meaning now if you get the ghost of tsushima game the multiplayer mode comes with it for free which is a great deal but you're now going to be able to buy the say you don't want to do the single player campaign you just want to play with your friends online you can buy the standalone ghost of tsushima multiplayer mode for 20 bucks which will be dope 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 on september 3rd september 3rd you'll be able to buy the multiplayer mode all by itself so we'll be on this mode before 2k drops because when 2k drops you already know the vibes all right so this was cool this was cool this was cool speaking of playstation 5s walmart had a major ps5 drop today but there's no point in me trying to go live as soon as the drops come because they they're pretty much within minutes they're sold out but today walmart had ps5s online only they had both the 500 dollars disc based version and the 400 dollars all digital version i did recently get a 400 dollars digital uh through uh gamestop but walmart had them today and this goes along with the news i gave y'all in the last video that sony has secured 12 million um, semiconductor parts 12 million consoles they're not worried about the shortage they've secured consoles for this upcoming year so expect to see these drops more frequently August and September get your PS5s when they drop bro because <laughs> once October comes and moms and dads right now it's primarily gamers looking for it and trying to get it but once the holiday, Christmas holiday season starts rolling around, grandmas, aunties, uncles, and everybody on the planet is looking for a PS5, it's going to be tough to come by. So, um, good to see that Sony is ramping up production for the console. My favorite console this generation, of course, by far. Uh, PS5 just been lit, though. Bro, this next news item is crazy uh no we're, we're gonna save the back for blood news last but this next one 
bro a playstation 5 dev kit <laughs> went on sale today on ebay and it got pulled down but before it got pulled down the bids were going as high as three thousand dollars three thousand dollars for a ps5 dev kit and of course <laughs> they're illegal to sell so whoever was trying to sell it whatever developer who got it or their, their son probably one of their kids their teenage sons or daughters <laughs> tried to sell it um but it got pulled down immediately but i thought that was funny bro just imagine bro you get a ps5 dead dev kit now i don't see a disc drive on this anywhere so it's probably been just an all digital uh thing so that would have been cool but um someone tried to sell it and it got up to three it got the price got as high as three thousand dollars before sony contacted ebay and like um can i take this down all right and the last news item for this video this is pretty cool this game never really been on my radar but i might try out the beta let's see if the beta uh, tickles my fancy but um back for blood the open access beta has gone live today it will be running today from august 5th uh, to august 9th this is the early access beta there's two ways you can get in th into this early access beta you can either pre-order the game or this is another one that's really funny or if you watch one hour of back for blood twitch streams uh, when the open beta is live uh, it will they will give you a early access code um, to play the early access beta from August 5th uh, from the 5th to the 9th now if you don't if you're like I might do that I might just put on twitch for like an hour in the background while I'm doing something else um if you don't want to get into the early access you don't want to pre-order the game you don't want to waste an hour of your time the open beta will be available to everyone on august 12th uh, where you could play um the game looks i it looks i uh so i might try it out i might try it out see how it is all right dudes that's it bro what do you guys think about all the news for this video sound off in the comment section below i want to know but before you go, bro, click that subscribe button. Stay up to date. All oh, things game, bro. We out, boy.